Hi, this is Roger with True Method, the pool care experts. Today we're going to talk about a clogged impeller. A clogged impeller happens when debris gets into your motor or your impeller and clogs the system. One of the ways you can tell if you have a clogged impeller is if your vacuum, if you have a vacuum, it's not moving around very well. Or another indication of a clogged impeller is if you do not have a lot of flow in your pump basket or your pump pot where it's not fully primed or if your PSI gauge, the black mark, is running low. These are indicators of a possible clogged impeller. So here we have a cutout of a, of a pump, of a motor, the whole system. And so this is how you clean out a clogged impeller. The primary tool you'll need is just a flathead screwdriver. What you wanna do is take your lid off and you're with the motor off, <laughs> you're gonna take uh, your screwdriver and what you're looking for is to fill any debris lodged in here and just move it around and you'll be able to tell with the screwdriver if you're feeling plastic from the impeller or any vegetation or debris and it'll start slowly pulling out. Just grab it with your hand and throw it away. Let's go see if we have one on our real pump right now. You first want to remove the cap, spin it off, take out the pump basket, grab your screwdriver, Put it in uh, the uh, return, clean around. Again, you're filling for plastic or debris. And here we are. I should probably clean this out too. <laughs> Put the basket back in. You wanna make sure your O-ring is here. No debris on your lid. Put some water in the pump to prime. Just a nice, firm hand tighten. And then you wanna make sure your pump primes pretty quick here. And there we go, we're back in business. If you'd like some more information on more videos on how to keep a crystal clear, ready to swim pool, as well as information on how to manage and run your equipment, click on the link below.